Uh, how'd you like to beat the heat with a cool glass of wine? Home crafting, a hot trend right now, that's for sure. And so what are you going to do with all those corks that are left behind? Say you have some friends over and they leave those corks laying around. Jessica Parsons is joining us this morning with some great crafting ideas. Good morning. Good morning, Olivia. First, I wanted to show you this wine glass. Check it out. And look at all these corks. I mean, do you have this many corks laying around your house? I don't know. But the fun thing about this is if you can guess how many corks are in there, you get a free wine and cheese group setting for six. Yes, a party for six. If you can guess the corks, we do it once a month. And I'm with Peggy. You own LDV Winery. And one of the fun things you do here is you offer uh, craft classes, and one of them is with corks. Yes, we try to use all of our corks, which we have a lot of them, obviously. <laughs> and we do workshops, and this is a crafting workshop this Saturday. Yeah, you got to drink a bunch of wine to get that amount of quartz. I mean, how you much? Do. You have to drink a lot. We're, it's a great party if you can get that many corks uh, collected, but that's about a 1,500 or so. And then how much, how many corks does it take to do the wreath? You've been working on the wreath this morning. I've been working on this wreath, kind of finishing it off. I would say that's several hundred that we put, uh, corks that we put on this wreath and you can decorate it up for the holidays or have it a year round wreath like I have it showing here. And in the class, you really don't have to bring anything. No, we have all the corks. We have a lot of glue guns. If you want to make something special, um, like some of these other things that we have showing, you just need to bring the frame or whatever it is that you want to use. But we have a lot. And I've been working on this Vino sign. It's really easy. You just put the corks in order, and you just use the hot glue gun, and that's it. Yeah, it's just a hot glue gun, easy. It's a great excuse to have a glass of wine while you're doing crafting. At 11 o'clock in the morning. At 11 o'clock <laughs> in the morning, right? Like we need an excuse. Right, and the classes, you said um, $10. $10. It includes the glass of wine, includes the cork, 11 to 1. A lot of people will probably think that's the best part, the glass yes, of wine, because exactly. some wine only co it costs $8 for right. the glass. Right, exactly. At our tasting room, it varies between $8 and $12 that people can come in and try our wine. One of the cute things, I think, is these um, bracelets. They're making bracelets out of cork now. Yep, the corks. We have necklaces out of corks. We have purses out of corks. So you can use do all kinds of things. This is super popular on Pinterest. I love love the purse. Isn't the purse just awesome? Uh, someone made that for me out of a cigar box. It's awesome. So if, uh, if somebody wants to sign up, how do they do it? They just need to come on down or register online at 480-664-4822. And so for the last hour, I've kind of been working on my own little project. I want to show you a little ornament because an ornament is something that you can make as well. And this one is for Scott Passmore. Ed, I like no that. surprise like that. there. <laughs> Very nice. Thank you. Oh, I had to. He's my celebrity crush. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. Jessica, good job. Thank you. Oh, yeah.